Now, CBS4 Weather with Chief Meteorologist Craig Setzer. Good for them and good for us because Karen is going to dissipate before it gets here. That's the forecast from the National Hurricane Center. Although it did get a little bit stronger today with winds of 45 miles an hour <clears throat> moving to the north, northeast at 12 right now. About to slow down and about to make that loop. It's going to basically pause out there uh, over the weekend and then begins to move to the west. Those L's just represent a weak area of low pressure, not a tropical depression, but a former tropical depression, typically called a remnant low, the, the leftover low pressure area. And then by Monday, it's forecast to dissipate, and that's the end of the track. It doesn't go to Tuesday because there's no more forecast points. So that's it. Say uh, we're not going to say goodbye to Karen yet because it's not gone yet, but we're not going to worry about it coming here either. In terms of Karen, there is Karen this afternoon. Here we are in South Florida. You can see the ball of thunderstorms with it. Look at this. This is Lorenzo. This is a monster hurricane. Category four. It's huge. The wind field is enormous with this one. The wind field extends about 250 miles across there, and it is literally going to be sending waves all the way across the Atlantic to the Windward Islands, even to the coast of South America. So big, big hurricane. Thankfully, it is going to stay in the ocean for the next several days. Could be a threat to the Azores up in the northeast Atlantic, but it should start to weaken by then. But this is a big, big ocean wave maker out there in the middle of the ocean. Here's our Wind Jam Resort camera this afternoon looking pretty good. Good beach weather. 86 in Miami, 84 Fort Lauderdale, Hollywood, 87 in Key West, a two on the stick and scale. Another dry day. Humidity only 48% gentle east northeast breeze lows this morning once again dipping into the upper 60s western areas of Broward Miami Dade temperatures right now are mainly in the mid 80s. Here's the computer model forecast. There's the dryer that's over us sticks around now. It looks like into the weekend. Maybe a little shower coming through on Saturday and then on Sunday. Another weak cold front comes through. The breeze picks up behind it. We'll also see some spotty showers here and there coming with that cold front that is on Sunday. For us tonight, we're looking good. A nice night cooler in the lows of right around 70 to the upper 60s on average, averaging the mid 70s. Tomorrow, look for once again plenty of sun, a little bit more humid tomorrow. We're not done with humidity yet. It's not that late in the season. 89 the forecast high for boaters. Winds east to 10 to 15. Season running 2 to 3 feet light chop on the bays and through the weekend warm sunshine for your Friday and Saturday a few showers on Sunday and breezy showers and maybe some thunderstorms in the middle of next week back to you thank you Craig